my child is, has a serious problem and it needs to be dealt with. Faith Backus isn't satisfied with the silence she says she's getting from the city. She was only recently notified her two-year-old son, Trevion, has lead in his system after his yearly checkup and blood work. Trying to get him a specialist. And I got to go and lose work. My husband, kids going to school, starting school, all that stuff. Now I got to go run around with my baby because he got lead in his system. Beck is now worries for her four other yeah. children, and she's blaming Newark's water. She joined dozens of others at Paradise Baptist Church in Newark today for help. This, as a community, was told just last week to stop using filters distributed by the city while more testing is conducted. Lead in the tap water at dangerous enough levels that no one should be consuming it. But particular concern surrounding pregnant women, seniors, and children under six. This is about the Newark water crisis and the people of Newark. For just over a week, bottled water has been distributed to some, while others are being told they're not eligible because their neighborhoods are not in areas the city deems as being directly impacted. However, distrust has forced Bishop Jethro James and Union County Assemblyman Jamel Holly to make this desperate plea and make sure no one is turned away from receiving safe drinking water. We've come to say give us water. We challenge every organization in the state of New Jersey to give us water. My involvement with Newark today and the situation that you are, are in um, pains me because this could have been prevented. In Union County, Holly has collected 17,000 bottles of water thus far in just one week. Beginning with three donation locations, he's now expanded to eight. His efforts for Newark residents are being applauded here, but criticized at the same time by Mayor Roz Baraka in this Instagram post from just a few days ago. Baraka insinuating outsiders should stay out of Newark business. Holly today responding. And when you're under crisis and you are faced with uh, an immensely amount of pressure, you say and you do things sometimes uh, because of that pressure. 